and here we see the museum in its original location at the Barbican as it was um, a few months ago. I was privileged enough to capture this now and then, or then and now, as it was actually happening. Um, anyone that wishes to see that, scroll back through the page a few months and you'll see complete coverage of the Museum of London where it was. And now on to where it's going to be. Good afternoon ladies and gents and what you're looking at here is the old um, Smithfield General Market and this is going to be where the new Museum of London is going to go so I thought I'd capture it now as it looks now show you a little bit like that but look yeah you can see Dent Brothers so, and as I read on the description they're going to be turning things like that into part of the museum so that you'll have a proper shop things like that but yeah they, they, the work's moving on quite quickly so it's nice to see and this is an old um, like gate hut type thing for it let's go out the way over here because that's the Smithfield meat market over there and this is Smithfield general market there are diff there are subtle differences between the two One dealt in flesh and the other one dealt in general items, obviously. It does exactly what it says on the tin. But yeah, this is some kind of um, annex building, gatehouse building, I'm not quite sure. Uh, but yeah, wanted to capture it now. As you, anyone that's been on the page for a while, uh, just before Christmas time, with the, um, the old Museum of London, which I must admit is a to my taste is a plug ugly building I must admit I don't like it at all but the old um, Museum of London is closing down or well, has closed down now and the uh, in 2026 the museum this is where it's going to be for anyone that doesn't know about that so yeah we've captured a little bit of history in the making this wasn't going to be a uh, a long tour but, yeah it's fascinating to um, and it's good to see the work coming on so quickly too. Trying not to get killed. But yeah, look, I mean, that's a newer part of it there. I don't know what they'll do with that. But I know the old stuff's all being kept because they've got like, um, gonna have like a glass roof kind of affair, which should look really good. So yeah, there we are. That's the old Smithfield General Market and you are seeing it in the process of being turned into the New Museum of London. This may not interest everyone, this little snippet, but for those of you that it may interest, I hope it did interest you. I'm gonna get some snaps quickly. There we are. I do like the architecture of these um, buildings, I must admit. Now I can see that it's all going, it <laughs> appears to be going ahead as, as it should be because I did have concerns that we would lose another museum. But yeah, it's nice to see the work all progressing very well. So that has pleased me. We should have a nice new museum in a lovely old building in a proper setting where it belongs. So, well, I've been out and about today. My first thing was uh, was a disappointment, unfortunately, because it was the main thing I wanted to access of it. I couldn't access because there's a gas leak out in the street. Um, the underground cells from the Viaduct Tavern, and the because uh, their cellar is obviously under the pub, and the cells goes further out into the street, and it can be accessed under normal circumstances, but because of the gas leak, unfortunately, it can't at the moment. Not until next Wednesday, so. I'm sorry. But this is Smithfield Meat Market. And that's the old Smithfield General Market. As I say, um, I covered the, the museum where it was. And anyone that's been to the old London Museum will remember that it wasn't the, the prettiest of buildings in the world. So, this is nice to see. I'm enjoying... Uh, well, I will enjoy the idea of being able to come back and cover it when it's in its new home. So, 
watch this space if I'm still alive in 2026 and the page is still going I shall cover that anyway thank you all for watching this end with something a little bit prettier take care everyone thanks for watching our next thing new ideas for a new museum join the conversation we are creating a new museum and there's less than one mile away at West Smithfield and it's going to be at the old um, Smithfield General Market building pause to read I'll take a screenshot but that's what we're going to have a, have a look at now welcome to our test space so this is a test space for the new museum a Roman shop Certainly bigger than the uh, one they've got in the Roman street at the moment. And genuine Roman artifacts. Anthra. Thry, whichever you wish to call them. And this is going to be the Roman house. I can come Friday. Possibly Sunday. <clears throat> I'm hoping on Friday that I'll have everything covered by then. So that's turned out to be somewhat of a Herculean task, as they say, but there we are. poster okay and I'm pressing it to try and make it progress how shameful no it isn't a poster it should hmm. it's not doing anything <clears throat> oh there we are let's make our feedback Roman army life, that would be a good one. So you give them feedback. As a visitor, we'll be able to follow a few stories. Work in life in the shop, life in the home. How we do to work daily tasks. Which is life and death because I'm a morbid person. That's okay. Anyways, over to this one now. You can Shape our new museum. You can share your ideas. 